And now a quick look at the third line. So our uh, left hand is starting on that low C note, isn't it? The second ledger line below the bass clef stave, below the bass stave. Um, your fourth finger will already be on C. So as the music says, leave it there. Um, and right hand copies two octaves higher. Now right hand, change that number two to a three. Much easier, just leave third finger. It's there already. You can probably work that all out, it's not too hard. And here we need to squish in both hands. So left hand, it's an E, isn't it? So it's two notes below the G of Great Big Dogs. And right hand, we should just know that's the E just above middle C. So left hand is doing E, G, second finger A, not one, so change that, and then thumb on the B flat, so change the number two in the music to a number one. So um, hands together, we just have that pattern three times. Then there's a very high chord, which the camera will probably, probably can't see, which we'll do next week.